Uh huh. Amber Skies, deck number four. Crinkle cut. Hide the code. Hide the Archon. Hey, we got our first Skyborn. Hold them up. Right, hide that bad boy. Guru P. Haggis. Might be kind of Scottish, Irish or something with that Haggis. Take this guy up. All right, what are we working with? <laughs> Yeah, somebody was telling me about a new keyword. I think it might be for the newest set, the Prophetic Visions. Yeah, I don't see it on here. Envy or something, I think he was saying. All right, we're starting off hot. Coming in hot with the Skyborn house. First Skyborn. All right, this is a Scalawag Finn. Okay, more Vikings. I thought Brobnar were kind of Vikings, but... I guess Skyborn. Oh, okay. This is probably a Brobnar person that is Skyborn. All right, but uh, six power after fight. Scalawag Finn heals three damage. Okay. Man, if you buff her up more, she'll be crazier. Two of those. Raiding party. Four power after fight. If two keys of the same color are forged, steal two amber. Otherwise, still one amber. Okay, come again. After fight, if two keys of the same color for it, still two amber. Otherwise, still one. Man, I thought the barons and everything were the only things messing with those keys colors. But no, it's all over the place now. So you got to watch which key you for is now. I like that. I like that aspect. I like it a lot. I always used to just uh, forge my red key last, but now you're going to really have to be paying attention. Steal two, otherwise steal one. Dang, my boys gonna have to really be paying attention. All right, rating party. My favorite card so far of the set. I like that. All right then, uh, Indigo Halyard for the uh, for the theme, of course. Uh, but uh, Indigo Halyard, a uh, human Halyard. While your blue key is forged, Indigo Halyard. Gains after reap, ready and fight with another friendly creature. While your opponent's blue key is forged, each of Indigo Howard's neighbors gains taunt. Wow. Okay, I wonder if they have a red and a yellow Howard. Are right, one of those, and it's a common, crazy common. Like that one too. Our right, uh, Chandler and Nuke. I never watched Friends. Is Chandler the guy who died? Or was that another guy? Joey or something? I think it was Joey who died. I don't know. Chandler, that might even be Seinfeld. I really don't know. Uh, but anyway, I uh, got a scrap hip on that thing. We got a... Each friendly flank creature gets plus two armor and gains taunt. Each friendly flank creature gets plus two armor and gains taunt. What's up? All right. Well, yeah, Skyborn Pirates, but this is definitely a Brobnar that turned Skyborn. I right, think we got Bosun Crean, three power, uh, Halyard Recruiter. Got a Skyborn Pip on it and Scrap. Move a creature to a flank of its controller's battle line. Okay, get stuff out of the position they want it to be in, or maybe yours. And we got a Shadows guy that's also Skyborn. Uh, Elf Assassin. Third of Cliff. Two power. Elusive. Action. If your red key is forged, destroy each enemy flank creature. 
but otherwise destroy an enemy flame creature. Nice. Loving it, messing with the key colors. I love it. All right, then we got Pirate Champion with the scrap, taunt, after fight. You may move Pirate Champion to a flank. Six power. Oh yeah, I think this guy is in the uh, Key Forge Adventures. I think I recall seeing this guy, Pirate Champion. Why not double use the art? Why not? I think we got Recreational Jettison with the one pip. Funny, this is the first Amber pip card in this deck. Uh, play, discard a card, resolve its bonus icons as if you played it. If a yellow key is forged, repeat the preceding effects. Play, discard a card, resolve its bonus icons as if you played it. If a yellow key is forged, repeat the preceding effect. Nice. Hey, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna throw this out there. There was this key forge like game on Kickstarter, I believe, years ago. I've been looking for this game for so long, I can't find it. If anybody knows the game I'm talking about, please leave a comment. Key forge like game. It probably never got completed, but this is from years ago. If you know what I'm talking about, I'll let me. I would, uh, anyway, this is rare, like that one, force the yellow, and another rare, Cloud Burst Command, your opponent's keys cost plus one amber for each Skyborn creature on a flank, okay, no wonder so much flank stuff, nice artifacts, and on to the Mars. Oh, we got one pip on it what needs calculation play if your opponent has more amber than you destroy an enemy creature if your opponent has more amber than you destroy an enemy creature cool number six one two five power splash attack two time man i liked it better when it was just splash i believe it used to be just splash but whatever wasted word but uh splash attack two taunt Kaboom. Play, put each Mars creature into its owner's archive. Destroy each creature. Gain three chains. Love it. When it's not being used against me. Um, intentional discharge. <laughs> That's what she said. Enhancement. Got a Mars pip on it. Uh, play, return a friendly creature to his owner's hand. If you do, ready a friendly Mars creature. Oh, okay. I'm t I totally would have missed that. You got to check all the cards now. But this one has disc pip on it, so you can play this in-house disc, or you can play an additional disc. No, I think I said it. I think I thought about the wrong thing, but I think it's like you can play this if you're playing a disc turn. All right, but uh, intentional discharge, enhance, play, return a friendly creature to its owner's hand. If you do, ready a friendly Mars creature. All right, hard to lose there. Two of those. Then we got Cobalt Capulet. Um, I wonder if we have uh, Onyx, I, I guess Onyx Montagues or something. Uh, three power, one armor. After Reap, capture two Amber for each of Cobalt Capulet's Mars neighbors. Bad. Brain Dart, one pip. Play, enraged enemy creature. It captures one Amber from its own side. Zip the, the Implanter. I gotta say, I'm sure a lot of this stuff came from Invader Zim. But, I mean, you know, Martians are Martians. But, um, three power, scientist Martian, elusive, after reap, take control of an enemy creature, destroy a friendly creature. Cool. Two of those. Then we got shark bait. One pip on it. Play, deal two damage to a friendly Mars, a uh, friendly non-Mars creature. If it's destroyed, it captures two. Okay, if it's not destroyed, it captures too. I hate putting damage on my own stuff, but get a pip and then maybe two more, so it's worth it. Well worth it. I think we got blip, 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 two power. After reap, the next Mars creature you play this turn and just play ready. Not a rare. And this house, two power vapor imp. After reap, discard a random card from your hand. During your opponent's next turn, they can't play cards of the destroyed, of the discarded cards type. 
Discard a random card from your hand during your opponent's next turn. They can't play cards of discarded types. All right, so you got to have the same house as the other guy. And, like, you know, you just wait until you spin down to your last card, and then it'll be less random. All right, then we got Serene. Rated this before, four power. Scrap deal two damage to a friendly creature. Mosquito, cool name. Three power, after fight, fully heal Mosquito, deal two damage to a creature. Love the ping. Mind fire, your opponent discards a random card from their hand, steal one amber for each bonus card on the discarded card. And we got a Skyborn pip. Man, it's like a three, four though so far in the deck. Uh, play your opponent discards a random card from their hand. Steal one amber for each bonus icon on the discarded card. Okay, random, so can't call it. Two of those. Infinity Strop, one pip. Play, deal two damage to a creature. If this damage destroys that creature, deal four. If this damage destroys that creature, deal four damage to each creature that shares a house with the destroyed creature. Deal two damage to a creature. If this damage destroys that creature, deal four damage to a creature that shares a house with that destroyed. All right, nice. Nice heavy damage right there. One pip. And then arise. Play, choose a house. Return each creature from of uh, that house from your discard pile to your hand. Gain one chain. Excellent recursion. Excellent recursion. Like, if you're at the end of the deck, bring it back like 12. No, no, no. Bring it back like what? Maybe eight. Man, like maybe eight cards to hand, maybe. Probably six cards to hand. That is great. Gain one chain. And the Gift of Amber. Got a Mars house and a regular um, Amber Pip. Play, destroy up to two creatures. For each creature destroyed this way, the creature's controller gains one. Another cool removal. Library of the Damned. One Skyborn. Man, this has to make like five house pips so far. Action archival card. Okay. Drumble. Two power. Elusive. Play. If your opponent has seven or more amber, capture all of it. Seven or more amber. Capture all of it. What? All of it. All of it. What? All of it. That can swing a game right there. That's crazy. Put you up there with the rares. Uh, that, not this. One. Oh, okay, okay. They finally did it. Okay, so the house is this. And there goes that. My type of stuff right there. Uh, one pip. Alpha. Play, choose a house. That house becomes the active house. Wow. Okay. So you drop this guy on the board. Or go in this house. Change the house to what you already have on the board. And then you just cheat it in. Ate this guy. Cool. Cool. I like. And last one is a rare. Dance of Doom. Play, choose a number, destroy each creature with power equal to that number. Can't hate that. Lots of good removal in here. Uh, guessing the sass. We have what? One, two, three, four. Five, five house pips in here. What looks like two scrap pips. Five house pips, two scrap pips. Not too much amber in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Kind of low on the amber generation. Seven amber. Your opponent's keys cost plus one for each Skyborn creature on the flank. 
Discarded card resolve its bonus icons as if you had played it. If a yellow key is forged, repeat the preceding process um, effect. Choose a number, destroy each creature with power equal to that number. I like the deck, but I'm not going to say it's OP though. But I'm going to just give this a quick... We do have a lot of house pips though. Can't front on the house pips. I'm gonna go with a nice middle of the road, high 71 on this one. 71. All right, um, they probably haven't added the sass, this set to the sass yet. But anyway, 71, that's my prediction. Maybe we'll see one day, maybe I'll post it in the comments. One day I'll take a day and just go through all the sasses and then comment on all the videos. But anyway, throw your games, like, comment, subscribe. We still got more decks. Y'all come back now, you hear?